Here's a video of some excellent recommendations from Brazil. I think a lot of the Brazilian death metal goes kind of unnoticed. There's some amazing fast bands from Brazil, just like Christian and Rebellion, Sepultura, some of the more common ones. But just like Czechia, Poland, and U.S., Brazil has been making some ultra-brutal great stuff. So here's some recommendations. Uh, pissed off people down in Brazil. They're making some pissed off music. Ancest ancestral malediction. And a demonic holocaust. They're split with Ophiola tree, tree. The ancient contradictions. This is a really good album. Await Rottenness. The Chaos Eternal. Bestial Final Presage. It's a nice production. So this is some of the more modern stuff. Modern, excellent production. Bloodwork, Just Let Me Rot album. It's another one that is just one of the best. Just a ripping, underrated Brazilian death metal. Embalmed Souls is a fantastic album. I have this on cassette tape too. The Temple of Bizarre Cult. Basically, it's some of the best death metal drumming that I've ever heard. Not because it's fast with a double kick and stuff, but because of the variations on um, timing and drum fills and attack and coordination. Embalmed Souls, this is just amazing drumming. Fornication, Unleashed Wrath, that's great pummeling stuff. Even better is their Descendants of the De Degenerated Race from Fornication, Brazil. Funeratus is a really great band. I've got their Echoes in Eternity. Storm of Vengeance. That's very, very good. And they're split with Decerebration. Is very nice too. Horn God. Definitely an unrated band. Chaos Bringer of All Revelations is really good. The Absit album is really good. Horn God is awesome. Imperious Malevolence is awesome. I've got their Where Demons Dwell. And at the earlier album, it's a self, uh, self-titled. These two are great. Imperious Malevolence, Infested Blood. So just like Christian, but you know, more bombastic production. This is outright, completely brutal all the way through. Legendary Christian. I've seen them in concert several times, and they just melt my face. Conquerors of Armageddon, Apocalyptic Revelation are a couple that I have that are really good. The underrated Laconist. Oral Death Blow is a really good album. And just absolutely amazing is this split album right here. This earlier split album from Laconist. Brazil, amazing. Um, Mental Horror, Proclaiming Vengeance. This one, some people might not even get it. You know, it's so fast that it's just <laughs> almost ridiculous. But it's just, to me, it blows my brain. Mental Horror, absolutely. Proclaiming Vengeance. Uh, Nefast, it looks like this, Conceived by Inhuman Blood. I didn't care for the first album, but the second album rules. Oligarchia is another band that's that's really amazing. Both of these albums are equally good. Necropolis and Humanovirus from Oligarchia. Finally, we've got Quiron, Impious Domination. I actually got this in the mail today and spun it, and it's just amazing. Just, it's front pickup, Fender Strat, play tremolo picking. It's pretty crazy. And then Sadistic Gore, Tools of Monstrosity. Another one that's just modern, awesome Brazil, great production. I'd recommend all these albums.